Avengers. Avengers War Across Time, issue number three. So I did review issue number one and two. Uh, this was my least favorite issue. Uh, we get to see this character right here. I'm forgetting the name of. He is having it out for Thor. Um, and he eventually causes a lot of and underground people. I don't really fully understand all of it. It's very weird. Very wacky, old school comic booky. But that's kind of why I like this line of comics. It's very old school comic booky. If you like old school like Avengers superheroes nonsense, that's kind of what this line is. And it's fun. It's kind of hokey. A lot of the dialogue is like, all right, this came straight out of the 60s. It's referencing events from comics in the 60s. But by the end of it, like, just to recap what happens in this book, you got this dude who's fighting Thor, takes his hammer by the end of the book, and Kang now seizes his opportunity to set up his attack on the Avengers. Well, when Thor's down, a million years down, which is kind of like where we were at before. So, because he, he knew that Thor was the strongest Avenger, and he was kind of worried about Thor. But, yeah, so, I don't know. I thought it was an interesting read, and I really enjoyed this comic. Let me know your thoughts, like, share, and subscribe.